Hey, what's going on, guys? Thrashback here. Welcome back to the channel, and welcome to another Team of the Week Wednesday. Hopefully, we get some pretty good cards. So I'm going to go ahead and set this up, let it load, and while it's loading, I'm going to go ahead and show you uh, a pack that I had earlier this morning. <laughs> oh, you got to be joking. What is going on with these cards, man? They're everywhere. All right, so it's still loading. It's still, I don't know what's going on with the servers here, but regardless, pack luck's been on fire lately. <laughs> if, you, if you didn't see the pack yesterday, I, I highly advise it. Best pack of the year, 100%, not even close. Regardless, I've had great pack luck. It continues, and hopefully we can continue it a little bit more today with the uh, new team of the week. Did I, just, did I just see who I think I saw? One second here. There's a few cards out that I really, really want to pick up. Carey Price, Victor Hedmans. It's not a crazy team of the week by any means here, but uh, there it is. Yeah, Shane Ghost. Ghost is. And there it is. Yep, Ghost. Man, I was looking at getting his Evo. I almost picked it up and decided not to. Sure enough, he gets upgraded, so that's kind of frustrating. Regardless, let's go ahead and uh, take a look at the team of the week. Now, if you are new to the series, you have no idea what's going on. It's basically a team of the week review. Give you my ups, my downs, and we open up some packs. Sound good? So yeah, Zabinajad, Nolan Patrick, Amy Vander Kane, Ryan O'Reilly, Matt Zuccarello, Brad Marchand, uh, Brock Little, I guess. I mean, we got a couple other, uh, couple other goals. We got uh, Joey Valeno. I'm excited to see him. Future uh, Red Wing, you know, Morgan Frost, but nothing too great. We got Tyson Berry, Victor Hedman, Ghost, and Weber. And then in net, it's Carey Price. Who's the backup? Eric Comrie. Eric Comrie. All right. And he's got burner, so that's good. Now, somebody keeps commenting, hey, you keep looking at synergies. Why do you do that? Why do you bother? Because the difference in synergies means that the price is going to be more or less expensive. If a card has burner, like Eric Comrie, he's going to go for 5k as opposed to 2k. You know what I mean? Like, it makes a difference. It really does. So, first off, you guys, a bit of Jad. Decent looking card, but... It's not a great team of the week. I'm going to tell you right now, this first line, I'm not touching. I wouldn't bother touching any of them. Second line, Martian will probably be pretty good. Ryan O'Reilly, you might as well just pick up his all-star card. Zuccarello will be a great addition, though. He's super quick as is. His base card is amazing. So, uh, yeah, 94 and 94. He's got good hands now. This is going to be a really good card. If you want to put him on your third or fourth line, he can get it done. He'll help kill penalties, but he's so fast out there. He'll probably get some short-handed opportunities as well. On uh, defense, I wouldn't bother with Tyson Berry. Victor Hedman... Not bad. I was using his 88 International Player of the Game card. Definitely a really good looking card. Uh, I mean, 90 stick checking. Great offensive and defensive awareness, sorry. This is going to be a really good card. And then uh, Ghost and Weber. Weber's going to have a cannon. But unfortunately, a lot of people probably took his uh, 91 overall during the Christmas rewards. Then Ghost, I really regret not picking up. However, this one does have Burner. It's left-handed with Burner. This is going to be an expensive card. I'm telling you right now, this will be an expensive card. It's not a lot of good left-handed defensemen in the game, especially with Burner. So there you go. As for Carey Price, I will say the same thing. I Well, we don't have Carey Price. We have Bo. What's going on, Bo? For Carey Price, I will say the same thing. I say every week, every goalie in this game plays different for every single player. Feel free to try him out. He may play really well for you, but I can't guarantee anything. Now, he has 90 overall, and it's Carey Price. He has a pretty good card this year, so you never know. I would stay away from everyone that's not... 88 overall. So, you got Marshan, you got Hedman, and Ghost. There you go. Those are, those are the only ones that I would bother with. Shea Weber is also a, uh, a good pickup. He's not super quick. He's going to be able to throw the body as a heavy slap shot. He might not be bad. Regardless, it doesn't matter. Let's open up some packs. Now, before we do go ahead and get into the packs, I realize there's also some prime times. We got Vinny Henestroza, Thomas Hurdle, 89, Joe Pavelski, and 94, Alex Ovechkin. We also have the all-star cards in packs, so hopefully we can pull a couple of those guys. Anything else? No? All right, let's go ahead and open up these packs. Now, it's not going to be anything crazy. This is not what this video is really about, the pack opening. It's not really about that. It's more or less going through the team of the week and my thoughts, that good stuff. But it's always fun to try and pull them, you know what I mean? So we'll start it off with the gold rare player packs. I did pull a uh, Elias Pedersen all-star game card, so I'd like to... Uh, William Carlson's not bad. I'd like to duplicate that. You know, I'd like to get another pretty good card out of here, but you never know. Um, maybe that, you no, know, primetime OB, 94 overall. That'd be nice. No? All right, Elias Lindholm. Not quite, but I'll take it. Not a big deal. We'll move on to the Gold Plus pack here, and then we'll probably do one more Gold Plus pack and call it a video. Hopefully, you guys are having a, uh, a good time today. I'll be streaming later tonight if you guys are interested here on YouTube. I was going to be streaming on Twitch. I'm going to pause this for a second. I was going to stream on Twitch. Decided to do what YouTube is really my home. 
Um, I already have a bunch of emotes. I already have a bunch of people who are members on the channel. I don't want to abandon them. So I'm probably just going to stream on YouTube for the most part for now on, just so you guys know what's happening. We got Matt Nieto, and it looks like my pack luck has run dry. All right, let's go ahead and do that gold plus pack. We'll call it a video. Hopefully you guys are having a good day though. Like I said, I'm feeling a lot better. My legs feeling a lot better. I get finally get to go back to work starting Monday. That's really exciting. So I'm in a good mood. So hopefully we can keep it going here. We got Tyler Sagan, 84. Can't complain with that. Anything else in this pack? Jake for Tannen. PK Subban, what a pack. Can't complain. And we got a glitched card. Now, how cool would that have been if it was something good? We got an 85 Subban. We got the Jake for Tannen, uh, Hut Diamond card, and a Tyler Sagan. Can't complain. Guys, that is going to do it for the video. Again, I'll be streaming later tonight. If you want to come check it out, I'd really appreciate it. You don't have to. But if you do want to come hang out, I'll be playing some games, opening some packs, just having a good time. Regardless, guys, that is going to do it for the video. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. I'll see you later.